Hey guys, this is Jake with Lifeline Pet Supplies. Today we're going to cover hooking up an oxygen concentrator to your incubator. You should receive an oxygen pack that looks something like this uh, when you order one of our incubators. So what we're going to do is just cover hooking up the oxygen concentrator to the incubator. And we'll be right back here in just a moment um, to show you how to do that. Okay, so I've opened up the pack here, and what you're going to see is you have a piece that looks like this. This is used for the nebulizer. It's got an attachment here. We're not really going to cover that right now, but what we are going to cover is your oxygen tubing. Uh, we're going to cover the inlet port here in the O2 adapter. Pretty simple to hook up. Of course, today we're using an Everflow QOPI concentrator and we're going to get started the first thing you want to do um, is you should have an output on your concentrator uh, ours is here on the everflow qopi that's where we're going to hook one into this oxygen tubing uh, so i'll do that and be right back here in a second okay so i'm back and i've got the one end of the oxygen tubing hooked up what we're left with here is the other end of the uh, oxygen tubing that came supplied with the pack we're going to turn the incubator here and you're going to have two ports this front port is for the humidity tube that should have a black disc in it this back one will have a black disc open up your door on the front and just pop that disc out and then the next thing you're going to do is insert this piece right here from the inside and uh, i'm going to go inside the incubator and show you how to do that okay so what you want to do is drop down your door and you've got that port at the very back side here you're going to see this adapter piece that looks like that. The big end is going to go through there, and it just pressure fits. Pretty simple. Just like that. And close up your door. Spin it over to this side, and you're going to see that end sticking out right there. So the next thing to do is just to put the other piece, which is the actual oxygen adapter, into that piece. Fits in there pretty simple. Um... I'm going to snug that up here. You just want to snug that up inside. You may have to go back inside and kind of tighten it up. And then I'll show you what to do next. Okay, so I've now snugged up the oxygen adapter. And this is what it's going to look like from the outside when you're just running uh, your oxygen concentrator to it. That other end of the tube you've got coming from your concentrator is right here. That end is going to hook right into the end of this adapter like that. And I'm going to pressure fit that on there, turn on the concentrator, and show you what it's all going to look like. Okay, so now I've got the end of the oxygen tubing into the adapter here, and we're going to turn on the oxygen concentrator. Makes a little bit of noise there when it first fires up. So the recommended setting for newborn puppies is to start it out at about 3 liters a minute. You can see that there on the ball. Just kind of want that floating right at the 3 line. That's our recommended setting, and that is going to pump oxygen into your incubator try to keep any of your lines from getting kinked and that is basically what it's going to look like right there and it's going to distribute oxygen out into that uh, adapter piece there now if you're not running the humidity system you can put the oxygen in this front port here uh, especially if you're using a cup of water in here you may need to, to move that to the front um, if you're not using a cup of water in there, you've got the digital setup, then your humidity is all being controlled up here. So there's really no need um, to do that. So the reason we run the humidity up here is sometimes it can affect the sensors in the back of the unit. So that's what you're looking at. That's how to hook a concentrator up. Like I said, uh, about three liters a minute is what we recommend for our incubators for newborn puppies. If you have any questions, feel free to email us at customerservice at lifelinepetsupplies.com. Don't forget to check out our concentrators available at lifelinepetsupplies.com under the dog oxygen concentrator section. Thanks for visiting and have a great day.